Okay, guys, this is it. We're back at it now. And this is the first final from the Black Belt Adult Male. And we have the Roosterweight division to begin. With the green and yellow belts, Lucas Pinheiro from Checkmat. He's up against Art of Jiu-Jitsu Atos representative Mikey Musumeci. <laughs> and straight away there with a double guard pull, but coming up on top early. Musumeci's going to lift him, though. It's an advantage on the board for Pinedo coming up so quickly from that from that double guard pull. But this is a position where Musumeci really, he's just so good. It's guard versus guard. I've talked to a number of his training partners and his teammates, and they tell me that nobody passes Mikey's guard. <laughs> it's just yeah. not possible. And his flexibility really is something remarkable. The big question is how is his conditioning? Because this is the first time that he's cut a substantial amount of weight. Yeah, he cut right. around about 14 pounds to get down to the rooster Jeez. weight division of 125 pounds. And, and at that size, that's a, that's a big chunk of your body that weight. That is a significant percentage of your weight. He's rolling underneath trying to barambolo, get the uh, barambolo going. Mikey, along with his uh, sister Tammy, fighting out of Florida, and representing the art of jiu-jitsu, students of the Mendez brothers, Hafer and Guy Mendez, the two legendary champions. They are very much practitioners and proponents of the modern jiu-jitsu game, the Barambolo and the inversions. Right now we see guard versus guard. Mikey doing his best to free himself from this position, but yeah. Pinheiro's doing a good job of actually shutting him down. That left knee, as long as he keeps it open, Pinheiro is going to negate that Barambolo hook there. It's, it's basically like a bear trap, but there they free their legs. One advantage on the board in the favor of Lucas Pinheiro. Mm -hmm. Two minutes down into this 10 minute black belt contest. Mikey Musumeci doing his best to try and get something going from this position, but so far, Pinheiro with his grips. Now, this is a nice leg drag attempt here. He's managed to, to drag the leg across his hip, but still got to free, still got to untangle his left leg. His, uh, Pinheiro's grip right there is pulling it in, so he's going to need to circle that leg to the inside. There he goes. There he goes. Flips over. Oh, looking for the truck position. Yep. He's almost got it. Pinheiro's doing his best to strip that hook. Almost, there it is. There it Locked is. In. Oh, Musumeci, he's so good, so good at getting that position. This is the one he favors the most. Pinheiro manages to break that truck position. However, it's still one hook in. Musumeci working nice. that neck as well. He's got that grip around. He's got the harness grip, but... Let's see if can't he has see. Oh, Pinheiro just about manages to shake him off. Yeah. So that's now two advantages to one in favor of Mikey Musumeci. Yeah, nice attempt there to get the truck. But uh, Pinheiro countered nicely, stepped over to the backside, freed his leg. A couple nice exchanges of leg position there. Pinheiro trying to pass through here, low pass with the left hand on the belt grip. She's left foot on that bicep. It's going to shut that down. Getting busy is Lucas Pinheiro. Yeah. Taking it up a gear now. See a little bit of a, a more active pace from the bottom. through going after a foot but this no nope. oh thought we would see another barambolo there from yeah. musumeci but 
I like the pressure of Pinheiro. He's doing a good job of, of keeping Musumeci on the run. He's really, he's, he's, he's not just shutting down the attacks of Musumeci, but he's, uh, he's making, he's keeping Musumeci on the defensive, and thereby, yeah. you know, making it difficult for him to attack. Yeah. Nearly gets by the guard. Go again, restarting. Almost at the halfway point so far in this contest. Pinero trying to leg weave pass, but I like the ankle control of yeah. pants there and really stretching Musumeci out, but the flexibility of the, of the youngster here, just something incredible. Yeah, rolling right upside down, but that, there's that ankle grip that you were talking about, Al. And look at Musumeshi rolling upside down to try to save his guard. Pinheiro will not let go of that leg, which is a great idea. Almost by here. This is something unexpected we I said it earlier that <laughs> many people have told me Whoa. that nobody passes but there is three points for guard pass Pinheiro settles into the side control and that is a legit pass yeah. now this is very very unexpected Michael Musumeci the super talented youngster on bottom using that lapel as a last ditch side control escape gives it up this is solid work from Lucas Pinheiro, the yeah. Czech man, black belt. He's yeah. really, that pressure, as I was saying, he shut down Mikey's attacks, not for any uh, counter attacks, but by simply being more aggressive and forcing him to react to his passing pressure. And wow, I mean, the result yeah. is on the scoreboard, 3-0 in his favor, just over excuse me just under three uh, just <laughs> just under four minutes remaining in this contest and Musumeci we saw him with that near back take earlier the very good work to get round there but yeah I have to wonder whether Pinheiro just seems to be the physically stronger of the two yeah he's just shut literally shut down most of the leg work done on Musumeshi to see if he can get underneath and get something going now. Yeah, Pinero's down. Oh, now into the 50-50. Two for Mikey. <laughs> Double checking with the referee. Yep. So nice. now it's 3-2 in favor of Pinheiro. Yes. And if anything, this is where Musumeci has got a better chance of scoring is with sweeps and reversals. Yeah, he's trying to dive underneath, roll underneath, and he's in a little bit of a pickle here. His leg is very extended. He's trying to bring that foot back in. And a counter toe hold, maybe. Yeah, there he goes. He tries that toe hold. Bounds on the leg lock battle there. So Musumeshi scores two for that foot lock, though, as they roll out of bounds. No, he scored two prior. My, excuse me. Indeed. Sweep. 50 50. And on the footlock attempt is Mutsumechi, possibly hoping to gain an advantage from that attack, but now 50-50 once again. Toe hold attempt. Yeah, toe hold attempt coming up, but really anything significant. Now it's a little bit better. It's a much better attack now. Pushing the armpit up to free uh, to hold. Mm. 
Nice leg position here. Musa Mishi fixed his leg position. He's got to bring this oh, left leg inside. Oh, he's going to go for that truck again. Yeah, there it is. Getting very close to the back here. This is good work from Musa Mishi. It's just this left leg. He's got to get out of there. So. Oh, he oh, slipped boy. in the hook right he on did. the call of time. They'll be drug. Yeah, they're going to go back into the center of the mat in the same position. So this is good work from Asimechi here, and this is a very strong position for him. Yep. That left leg he'll throw over the top. Pinero's got the grip on that pant leg, but that, that's not going to last very long, especially if as he starts to attack that neck. If he breaks that grip, that hook's coming in. Is. Mikey with a strong choke attempt there, actually. Yeah. Pinheiro's doing a good job of hiding that second hook by hugging his own leg, hugging his thigh, de de denying Musumeci that second hook. But it seems that Musumeci, this time on the neck, he fell off the back last time. But it really seemed this, is, this looks deep. This looks really deep here. There it is, yep. Musumeci with the body triangle now, six, three. It's Michael Musumeci. Now he's just gripping now. I think he's going to try to hang on here. Oh, nope, there's the collar grip. Yeah, we've got just up 20 seconds left in this match. And with the very solid back control, he got the points there. But no still looking for the yeah. submission. Yeah. <laughs> he walked those legs up there. And I think he could finish oh, here. Oh, he looks like he's got it yeah, That's pretty very tight. close. Dying seconds, five seconds left in this match. That is tight, let's see. Got the foot behind the head, but, oh, Pinheiro just about hang on. Wow, I've got to say, Mikey Musumeci really impressed me in that match. Moment of danger there. Amazing turn of events. Got his guard passed early in that match. However, coming back with a sweep and then taking the back. That was a very solid win for the yeah, Aster. Yeah, he really did. He came from behind, kept his composure. Wasn't easy. No, Pinheiro was doing everything correctly there, but the two times he made the mistakes were both that truck position. He was able to lock that down on the second one, though. Converted, got the back. And there it is, your winner. Michael Musumeci.